Peter, we have a hamper. Stop throwing your dirty clothes in the toilet. Peter? Peter, where are you? What's all this? Oh, hey, Lois. Welcome to the peat pad, where the dancing's hot, the drinks are hot, everything's just freaking hot. What have you done to the attic? Well, when I slept up here the other night, I realized what a great space it is. So I dragged up some stuff and turned it into a sweet hangout. Even made it extra awesome by stealing a real street sign. I don't understand. What are you going to do up here? Eh, mostly just burn the roof of my mouth on unevenly heated microwave burritos. Now I'm busy, so close the floor and get out of here. These new digs of yours are pretty great, Peter. Hey, I brought construction paper and markers in case you guys want to draw breasts. Cool. But before that, who's up for another insulation fight? I'm in. Heck yeah! <laughs> <laughs> gotcha! <laughs> <laughs> That's me! <laughs> what are you doing up here? I need you to take the trash out. You know what? I'm gonna use this Peter doesn't have to take out the trash coupon that I got for my anniversary. You gave that to yourself. I don't know. It says official. Oh, forget it. I'll do it myself. This whole attic business is ridiculous. Hey, guys. Check it out. I'm a lady. Joe, you hit a home run with that. I want to try it. Chris, I'm putting together a load of laundry. You got anything? <laughs> Peter, are you guys playing lawn darts in the attic again? No. Yay, lawn darts! Peter wins lawn darts! She's dumb. She got no idea. <sighs> <laughs> All right, Peter, that's enough. It is time to get out of... What the hell? Oh, yeah, we put Joe in Stewie's old jolly jumper. You told me this is a paratrooper's harness. Shut up, baby man. That's it. This is our home, not some frat house for you and your friends. Now, I want you out of this attic now. No way. We ain't leaving. We're having too much fun up here. Quagmire just showed us his Eric McCormick impression. There could be no such thing. Well, that's what I said, but then he did it, and I was like, oh, all right, okay, yeah, kind of. Fine. You like the damn attic so much? Then enjoy the attic! <laughs> did... did she just lock us in here? It looks like it. Guys, yeah, spin me back. I didn't see what happened. Jeez, Lois is really serious. I can't believe she left us up here all night. Damn it, we gotta do something. Maybe if we just scream for help, someone will hear us. Help! 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 In case of a bear attack, you should A, lie down, B, run down hill, or C, stand your ground. Peter, I'm going crazy up here. We all are. You gotta talk to Lois. Damn it, you're right. Lois! Let us out of here! No way! You like it so much? Then you can rot up there with your buddies! Lois, so help me God, if you don't let us out right this second, I'm gonna take a dump on your wedding dress! You wouldn't dare! Don't test me! I'll do it! We'll all do it! Quagmire, pull down your pants! What? I'm not doing that! You leave my dress alone, Peter! If it'll get us out of here, I'll make a duty on it. What are you, nuts? I've been crowning for six hours! Cleveland's pants are off, Lois! Here come mine! This is happening! Lois, they're not bluffing! Open the door! I miss Bonnie! Damn it, Peter, you hold that in! I know you can! You did it on the ferry to Block Island! Oh my god, I'm gonna puke! That's good! Puke on the dress! Puke on the dress! Ah, oh, damn it! Not all snake bites are lethal. There! You happy? You were too late. We pooed on the gown. Ripped a big hole in your ceiling, too. I barfed on Peter's ass. I, I don't know if it got on the dress or not, Lois, but I, I, am, I am so sorry. Yeah, this was all a huge disaster. Let's just agree that we both went a bit too far, hmm? I, uh... I might, I might need two weeks off from this friendship.